Art for me personally is like oxygen. It is the place where I don't need to be anyone else. I think it's the place where I can communicate the best. And at a bigger picture, I think art really is a great way for us to digest and, and evolve and transform our lives. From the beginning, I knew I wanted to create a mural that really revealed that potent beauty that exists in this fragile connection between humans and nature. And how can we, with small acts, be part of this new world in which we aim to create more connection. One of the things we want to do with small acts is really have people register that's something that they can do at home every day. And art is this really great connector for everybody in the community. It's an opportunity they can see themselves in the imagery and it gives you that sense of possibility and transformation. So I feel really encouraged that this piece of art will be a day-to-day -day reminder to people that the small things that they do in their daily life can make a big impact. I hope the mural invites the public in general to reflect on our ability to effect change by choosing small acts and to be able to recycle more and reduce our waste as well as value our, our resources. I like the aspect that the mural is connecting that daily activity in your household to nature through the, the butterflies, the vines that are growing. It's really telling that story. What you do can turn into something incredible if we make those small acts part of our day. I do think that there is a direct contact with the community when you work with art. So I'm really happy that many organizations from big and small are supporting public art as part of their own strategies. For the cult community, I hope murals like these really do create a sense of belonging and spread more positivity around um, multiculturalism and women empowerment.